Okay, we are at um, 51 Sawmill. Um, this is one of the two homes on Sawmill that are probably not going to have transfer tax. This is your front, a little more modern looking way up there if you can see it. As you come into the driveway, it is an actual three car garage. As we continue around here, a little deck off some guest rooms, taking advantage of some sun. Uh, that is the backyard of the home that we were in um, that you seem to have some interest in, but it was a little on the higher side. <clears throat> I kind of come into the front entrance here. Hot tub is placed here, taking advantage of some sun. Pretty nice outdoor living area. Fire pit, looks like natural gas. There are a lot of ways to get in and out of this house. A lot of doors going to the outdoor space. As we come in the main level, I'm gonna show you again, huge garage, three cars. And as you come from here on this first level is one of the living areas, a den, TV room, wet bar area, powder room. Pretty darn nice. Open, high ceiling. We come into the main kitchen level. It's a very nicely appointed kitchen again. Kind of a little breakfast nook, extra table, main dining area. There's a porch with another dining area, sunroom, sun, sunlights, um, access to the outdoor living space again. Come into the kitchen and show it a little closer. Huge stainless fridge, granite, microwave, wine, fridge, six burner stove, Double oven, everything you need. We come into here, one of the bathrooms, guest bedroom, looks like two, full size bed, closet. On the main level, storage stuff, ski equipment and whatnot, um, laundry room, we'll go up, here a nice little warm spot even in the winter, this opens to the um, dining table that was on the deck. With the aspect of the sun, this will probably always be warm. To a little nook here. Office with a little place to get on the porch. Another one of the bedrooms. Two doubles or queens. Bathroom with a shower, closet, another little outdoor living space.
space here. That is four o'clock run road. I know you're a big fan of roads. That's There's hallway, another bedroom. Pretty large bath. That door goes to the same deck that we were just in. This room is a little bit lighter with the shades open than I can show it right now. But another nice size room. This would probably be considered the master. Large room, seating area, large walk-in, step-up walk-in closet here. Larger bathroom, double sink, and shower, glass down. up these stairs to another area of the home. Kind of a nice bedroom here. See how they've configured it as a bunk room. Six beds in here. Going to a guest bath. Hopefully this gives a little idea of the scale of the room. Another bathroom. Into, so that's kind of a Jack and Jill bath with another bedroom. Back down this hallway. Through the open kitchen area. Large owner's closet with second laundry. Lots of storage. Can't see it there, but it is a sink. Nice little seating area. Into the theater room. Owner's closet. Twelve, I believe, can sit in here. Another owner's closet. They're locked. Pool room. Um, Bring back out to the main level. Back to the kind of kitchen. Really open concept, a lot of space area. This is 51 Sawmill, 1.79. 420 a square foot at 4265 square feet.